Russell knew at 4 o'clock. Uh, election day is still over a year away, but already one Illinois Republican is jumping into the race against Governor J.B. Pritzker. Our political reporter, Tamon Bradley, is here with an introduction. Van and Lourdes, hello. Paul Schimpf is a Republican from Waterloo in the Metro East area. He's firing up his campaign for governor early. I'm Paul Schimpf. I'm running for governor. Stand with me now to renew Illinois. With that, the 2022 governor's race is underway. Former Republican state senator Paul Schimpf enters the Republican primary. I think we need a, a, a governor who truly can understand and empathize with the day-to-day -day challenges that the people of Illinois face, and I'm that candidate. In launching his campaign, Schimpf is taking aim at Governor Pritzker. Governor Pritzker has been a catastrophic failure as the governor of our state. Uh, he is you know, he has badly mishandled the COVID-19 pandemic. He's also not really uh, leading in terms of solving any of our state's long-term problems. I spent my life in the military. Schimpf, a graduate of the U.S. Naval Academy, served as a Marine infantry officer and military prosecutor. He says the service taught him how to work with people from all sides of the political spectrum. When I hung up my uniform for the last time, that didn't change who I am. I do believe you have a duty to serve your country, your state, and your community. I want to see a vibrant Illinois that has a responsible government, safe communities, and economic growth through the free market. Schimpf is highlighting his moderate credentials. I'm a, I'm a centrist on union issues. In a statement, the Illinois Democratic County Chairs Association slammed Schimpf's labor record. Illinoisans should be very weary of this wolf in sheep's clothing. Paul Schimpf has built a facade of being pro-labor and moderate. When given the opportunity to prove that during his short time in the Illinois Senate, he opposed key labor issues like supporting increasing the minimum wage. Schimpf was the Republican nominee for attorney general in 2014, losing to incumbent Lisa Madigan. That was the same year voters elected Bruce Rauner governor. One of the lessons that I learned in that attorney general campaign is that it doesn't matter how good of a candidate you are, if you don't have the resources to get your message out, you're not going to win. Democrats are also highlighting Schimpf's support for former President Trump. In our interview, he danced around Trump. The challenges that Illinois faces are enough that, uh, that that's where my focus is. Another Republican is reportedly set to enter the race soon, State Senator Darren Bailey, who challenged Governor Pritzker's COVID executive orders in court. Republicans are looking for someone who will be able to unite the party, but also someone who can raise boatloads of money for the general. The challenge for a former state lawmaker like Schimpf is what happens if a well-financed or self-funding candidate joins him in the GOP primary. Mm -hmm. Lawrence, okay. Thank well, you, Tom.